If you play Ubisoft games, you've experienced problems with Ubisoft Connect, it's nothing new. My name is Yadullah, you're watching Canada Technology and in this video we're talking about how you can fix Ubisoft Connect not launching or not popping up. So the first thing that we're going to do as usual is open up the start menu and head over to the Ubisoft Connect app. Instead, we're going to right click this and click on open file location right here. Now this will launch up a shortcut. So we're going to right click this again and click on open file location again to get to the executable file. Now right click this, uh, head over to properties head over to the compatibility tab and in here uh, you have a few options so check on run this program as an administrator click apply click ok and then relaunch ubisoft connect now another thing that you can uh, do about this is you can try and run it in compatibility mode for windows 8 some people say it works some people say it doesn't so you can try this one out in any case run this as an administrator click apply click ok and then try relaunching the program The next step is to delete cache files. Now before you do that, you're going to have to launch Ubisoft Connect and log out because uh, as long as you're logged into the program, your cache is not going to be deleted. So fire up Ubisoft Connect um, and head over to your profile icon right here and then click on log out. Once you've logged out of there, you can close Ubisoft Connect and even close it from your system tray if you see it running there if it's not then we're good to proceed so press windows key plus r on your keyboard to open the run prompt and we are going to type in percentage local app data percentage sign hit enter and this huge folder with a lot of files will open go all the way down until you see the ubisoft game launcher folder what we're going to do is just delete this so you can just do shift and delete on your keyboard or right click hold shift and click the delete button once the folder has been deleted go back re uh, launch ubisoft connect and log in with your password and username and the problem should be solved the next step and uh, this one varies from person to person but you can try changing your password to get ubisoft connect to sort of re identify your account now doing this is also very easy we just fire up ubisoft connect we'll give it some time to load as usual not very good at performance ubisoft click on your profile icon right here and head over to profile now uh, you will see all of your activity here and if you don't see a uh, change profile or edit profile button here click on it again and head over to account management this time now uh, in here you have uh, some other option you can access your account information here we're going to security and this is where your two-step verification settings are payments and subscriptions and all of that stuff is ready up what we're going to do is click on this link so ubisoft.com slash account information and this should open up in your browser now uh, you're probably going to have to log in all right and uh, you will be inside of your login accounts all right now we head over to security and on the password option go ahead and click change this will send a password reset link to your email address and then you go to your email open up ubisoft's email follow that link to change your password once this is done log out of uh, ubisoft connect you should automatically be logged out but in case you haven't log out once and then try logging back in again ubisoft connect should start working And last but not least, if nothing else works, your best bet is to go ahead and completely reinstall Ubisoft Connect. To do this, press Windows key plus X to open the quick access menu and head over to installed apps. This will open up a list of apps on your system. We are going to find Ubisoft Connect and it should be somewhere at the bottom. Keep going down, keep going down. That's rain meter. Yep, Ubisoft Connect right here. Go all the way to the very end click on these three dots click uninstall 
now this will ask if uh, everything will be installed are you okay with it we know so go ahead and click uninstall again and from this point onwards you can head over to ubisoft's official website and re-download the launcher set everything up again and the problem should be solved if you like this video consider subscribing give us a thumbs up press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below what more such content can we make for you if you'd like to know more about tech visit our website candid.technology follow us on social media follow me on instagram or twitter and we'll see you in the next video